The bird was busted. She buried her nose in no man's land a half mile due west of where I went down. Wilson, the poor sap, didn't make it out. But that was his bad luck. I had more pressing problems. I'm just gonna say I've had plenty of practice moving quietly. Out the back of bars, bedroom windows, you don't need the details. Anyway, once those Germans were gone, I put my skills to work, heading west towards the British front, quiet as an alley cat. Between me and the British front were German trenches and German guns. Oh, and half the population of Berlin, all spoiling for a fight. day. The Brits must have been sitting down for tea and crumpets instead of shelling the Germans. Still, I had to get through to our side of the line before those guns started up again. mit deinen Augen los. Hm. 
Those trenches were packed full of the Kaiser's finest, but hopefully, most of them would be looking for trouble coming the other way. Hopefully. Ich hab das alles hier so satt. Würden uns diese Bastarde nicht die Arbeit wegnehmen, hätte ich nicht zur Armee gehen müssen. Hör zu, Arschloch. Hör zu, ich geh nicht auf die Posten. Das mit den Harlem Hellfighters. Sind die in unserem Sektor? Nein. Gott sei Dank. Das ist mir egal. Das Hast du das verstanden? Das, runter. das Aber ich ist Freund, mir der egal. Kapiert? Es gibt ernste Bedenken, weil einer unserer Front öffnet. A dozen German machine guns at my back kind of encouraged me to keep my head down. No Man's Land was a maze of barbed wire, dead bodies, and debris. But I held my course. Did anything survive the crash that might be useful? Rackham, are you? Son of the fourth bloody Earl of Windsor. <laughs> How naive do you think I am? Oh. Uh, Let's get out of here. The guy was losing a lot of blood. I didn't have much time to get him. This is your bloody fault. The Germans aren't really known. Thank <laughs> you. 
Wilson said I was a no good, lying son of a bitch. I brought him home because I think he's probably right. And I hate that fact more than I can tell you. This guy's a bloody hero. No, he's nothing of the sort. He's a cheat, a thief, and a liar. And he'll answer for his crimes. That's right, Blackburn. 